it's gonna be a bad night. Drop a thumbs up, subscribe the if you're new, and let's check it out. The was shared by Felimundo, and he tells us that he had captured it via Snapchat to share it with Snapchat? a bunch of his friends. Apparently, the young man was standing in front of his aunt's house in Gainesville, Florida, to smoke a cigarette at around 7 a.m. in the morning. He then noticed the cigarette is bad for health. Don't do that. Strange reflection in the door right across from him. The interesting part about that. The neighboring house was still uninhabited after the owner had passed away a few weeks Ooh, prior. Feli states that weeks whatever far. was captured here wasn't fully visible to the human eye and the creepy eh. details only surfaced after rewatching the footage on the phone. Ow, it's going down! Yo, this will be bad. So he says, I see the Shiza. If you're brand new, definitely subscribe. We love videos like that over here, man. Okay, whoa, whoa, what the? That's a face. That's a face. What? The what? Bro? You're seeing this? So he is zooming in. That face is not moving. Bro, like, start. Yo, run, dude. Like, or try opening the door, actually. You know what? Like, you want to see what happens. It might be like a Shivava or something. I don't Bruh. know. It's not there anymore! Oh my god, yo, bismillah. Yo, you gotta... It seems like that that thing is also... Is it moving? Is it going up? I'm talking about that brown the creepy face thing. is staring at him from the upper part of the door window, and then it just vanishes into thin air. Feli even checked after that. What if it, if it was someone that was kind of bored and just wanted to look uh, look outside for a minute and... Bruh. It could be someone just bored, right? Just to make sure that it was no intruder and he could find nothing. Damn. Damn. Do you believe that this could have been the former owner, perhaps? The young man also goes to say that this was not the only really weird incident on this piece of land. I don't know, man. That's kind of like one of those bumbukla moments. Only right the there. first that he could capture on camera. Interesting. Okay, two shots fired. I gotta say, bullets. Bullets are precious, man. As one man once said, bullets are more precious than people. In one of the Call of Duty game, actually. Hospital? The next clip was uploaded by user Arachnid Altruistic, and he oh, states shit. that the footage we are seeing here was filmed off another person's phone at a get-together. The incident in question was rather creepy, however. The video was filmed in a hospital during the preparation for a going-away party for one of the hospital's staff. We can see a nurse who is pushing a cart with some unfolded boxes. The young woman who had captured her colleague explains that she was recording several videos of her Damn. only a few seconds apart from each other in one of the short clips something rather eerie was captured okay what so that? what can yeah. happen here the next clip is a peg that's the person that does not exist and it's real and then like that person disappeared. Disappeared. so the guy that kind of just appear out of nowhere you kind of see a little shadow there pop up yeah yeah the, yeah and all you see is Wendy's body. Oh, damn. But his face, if you go a little slower, you can see it completely. Let me go. So it's right. There, you can catch his face. Yeah. Yo, that, that's a homeboy out there, though. That's a homeboy. Bro. That's interesting. So, homeboy was just trying right. to photobomb. And then he's gone. Damn. And the shadow pops up Ow. right here. There and gone. Yeah, the strange head is popping up right behind the stack of boxes. Nobody knew this person though, or had seen him ever before. Also, the head can only be seen for a couple of frames before disappearing to the left, only to possibly pop up once more. The staff stated that the workers were pretty terrified after watching the video. And there are many who believe. Do not look behind you. Don't do that. Believe that I, this might. I know you wanna do it, but don't do it. It's not recommended. Might have been the spirit of somebody who's still lingering around in the hospital after passing, maybe participating in the preparations. Who knows? Bruh. 
brother, brother, but why though? Why did he do that? Shadow in my home? Now we are looking at an update from Ow. user WinMCPix, who had shared some eerie poltergeist encounters from his home, in which oh, he and his family is living in. The spirit loves to spook the whole family, including his little son. Oh, I think I've seen the that clip on YouTube. Maybe the activity hey. has elevated from loud and terrifying rattling noises to full-on shadow sightings. This clip was captured one night after Wynn was woken up by a loud bang. Yo, it's getting real, man. It's getting really serious. Uninvited. I feel like a b either bizarre Hello? bug or maybe not. I mean, this is a follow-up, no, right? So no, maybe no, no, no. yeah. No, oh, no, yeah, 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 yeah. What? Yo! It's Yo, okay. that dog bark just scared me, bro. Like, okay. And then you see this? The shadow Pow. was just sitting in his chair, possibly waiting for Wind to show up. Creepy. A few nights after that, their security camera outside of their home has captured the following incident and alerted the family that movement had been detected at the time. Damn. Movement? Watch carefully. Yeah, 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 I see that, I see that. I gotta reload. Cover me, I'm reloading. Full, uh, flood, uh, floodlights detect motion. Damn. Hey, whoa. It might be the spirit of a uh, floodlights turn back off. Am I reading it wrong or did it really say floodlight? I don't know. It sounds kind of bizarre. Okay, now you see it here. <laughs> Didn't even pump any brakes. The family whatsoever. had never seen such a weird object, and the way it moves makes it pretty unrealistic for it to just be a light reflection from the street or from the neighboring houses. They are certain. Yo, that's that definitely a spirit of Bigfoot, man. Bruh. Bigfoot, ladies and gentlemen, Bigfoot caught on camera, bro. But this capture is connected with the scary encounters in their home. Could this be? Bruh, brother, brother, brother. Just floating? Eh? Eh? Just floating? What do you mean by just this floating? This short bro? clip was aired by a Mexican TV channel who was showing this interview at the time, in which the man to the left was telling the audience about his work. I'll What's put it here, quite man. mysterious is the misty object in the. I just couldn't even figure out where to place my face cam, man. Background that captured the attention of several viewers. So there's it's like really something. hard to make out what we are looking at here. Yeah. Some say it does look like the outlines of a hovering human. Others believe it just to be a strange light reflection from somewhere. What's your idea? All I gotta say is that, bro, like. <laughs> That, that kind of idea on camera live <laughs> but what why that mofo was taking his uh, boots off like that i want to know about that plot more graveyard ghost now we're taking a look at another news station video Yo, this is actually why a news like a real news channel bro okay this is gonna be wild in if this case it was shared by news channel 13 on the recording we see journalist sam hassler doing live shots during the morning news from the green ridge cemetery in saratoga county advertising and informing their viewers about the so-called spooky twilight tours <laughs> The viewer reached out to Sam after Bumbaka! Spooky Twilight. I mean, come on, son. Like, ah, ah, damn, man. Like, towards on. and told her that there was something behind her to the left side of the screen. As you oh, can see behind me oh, here, shit. we have a few gravestones, but what you can't see because it's dark out. And as you can see behind me here, we. Somebody just like started like did a Naruto run, man. Like, I, yeah, that person is doing a Naruto run. Like, to some, this looks like a spooky orb that is passing by the graves in the background. Could they be onto something? Some residual energy, perhaps? <laughs> Who stated that there were no moving lights at the scene, and even traffic lights seemed very unlikely. 
I mean, can it actually be fog? Like, my, my knowledge is kind of very weak on that kind of stuff, but could it be, like, fog, like, kind of rolling in? Maybe, like, a small... Just, like, a little bit. I, I know it doesn't kind of make sense, or maybe it does. I'm not sure. You be the judge. Any fog specialist in my chat? Any scientist, perhaps? Let me know, man. What do you think that could be? So... Like, what was let's it? Let's try to go against it, right? Let's not. Let's try to come out with some rational, rational bl uh, explanation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the word. Then. Thoughts? Damn. Live on news, though. So the footage is most likely legit. The following but video there's gotta was be an captured by D. Reichno, who was recording this eerie footage in her very own basement. The woman states that this house was built in 1909 and that she always felt like the place was haunted, but so far couldn't capture any evidence of that. The basement in particular was home to some extremely creepy noises and voices that seemed to stem from behind the nether. She and her partner went downstairs into the basement today to grab a few tools and they asked this being for permission. Take a look. I mean, if it's your house, is it there? I'm not, I'm confused. So, hey. it's a basement. Hey. Hello. Hey. Creepy Eevee. Oh. So, what could Hi. happen? Are you okay down here? Oh, damn. Is it We're there? We're just looking for some tools, that's all. Is that okay? Yeah, you don't want to mess around, huh? Like, if you know... Morning, I don't hear it. Oh, damn, yo, this is getting bad. Like, yo. we're gonna leave now unless you have something to say. Show us a sign. Just let us know you're okay. Yeah, we ain't gonna bother you. We come in peace. We come in peace. Hey, man, we come in peace, bruh. We come in peace. We come in pre. Hey, I hear a lot. Some extremely creepy breathing noises can be heard that are unaccounted for. Several people believe this to be demonic perhaps. And then there's also a creepy pair of eyes staring at them from underneath the stairs. Where? Where? Underneath? Where? I don't see it. recording on the setting. By itself? Yep. Where? Whoa. Oh, damn! Hi! I come in peace. I come in peace. Bruh. Those bullets didn't even affect him. What? Those are not eyes, bro. Like, those could be, like, something else, man. Like, D maybe is certain that they Damn. are dealing with a haunting here. And that these are not the eyes of an animal. Or an yeah. easily explainable reflection from an item. What That's do you think? Saying. Either an animal or a reflection. Because, like, it's not moving the... I don't know. It's kind of bizarre. But how would I know? Like, I'm not the expert. This video was shared by Silas Niposh, and he states that it got recorded one day when he was just out on a skiing adventure with some of his friends. They were high up in the mountains when he noticed some pretty unusual activity. Bad idea, bad idea, shouldn't be that high. Activity unfolded at the other side of the plains where some larger trees were situated. He grabbed his phone and started recording. Started recording. Whoa. Yo, you hear stories. What? You hear stories about like Bigfoot and stuff like that just taking down trees and Something taking I'm it with them. Brother. Brother. Are we gonna see another one? Oh, and we are. Oh my. What? Bro, brother. We saw something, right? Like a big ass person, though. Damn! It didn't look like Bigfoot, it just looked like a human. But like a very tall, like a big ass human. Okay, let's pause it here. Okay, so this is kind of like the head, but it's very hard to make out though. Okay, we're gonna run it back five seconds. Five seconds back. Very hard to make it out, would but appear that an inhumane tall creature is ripping out the trees and carrying them away. But how is this possible? Silas stated that the video is 100% real and that no video editing is taking place here. 
do you think? Okay, I don't know, man. When you say it like that, it makes me think that it's probably fake. Bruh. <laughs> makes me just feel that way, but... I mean, how else someone is supposed to make you believe, right? They're gonna be like, bro, 100% real, man. Or are they gonna be like, no, man, it's not real, bro, it's not real. They're gonna surely say it's 100% real, no editing, no green screen. It's real, it's the real deal. And it, it looks legit, though. It really does look legit, like... I don't know, man, but you see this person right here, right? That's a big ass person. And even even if it's even if it's let's just say a six feet tall mofo, maybe a seven feet tall mofo, like just a normal person, right? The the fact that just taking down trees like that, you gotta be very strong for that. This could just be an irritating perspective, making things appear larger than they really are. Could be. Many could commenters be. believe that something rather inexplicable is going on here, though. You yeah. can say. I've seen a Mr. Bellin video once and he was talking about a story where there was, a, I believe, a police officer that went into, I believe, woods. Uh, and he was noticing someone was chasing him. And at one point, I believe he saw. And basically, the thing was that he was, when he assumed there was someone chasing him he started running and when he was running there was someone behind him that was knocking down trees we're not talking about just one tree two trees just knocking down trees like bam, 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 bam. like very fast as though someone was chasing him and trying to scare him away and there were big ass trees that were falling down which is like uh, unusual like like one tree falling down okay maybe understandable right like whatever but then you experience like more than 10 plus 20 plus trees like knocking down that fast and we're talking about like thick ass trees that was kind of like you know what i mean it's uh I, I i i heard that story i watched this video and i was imagining that situation with this one oh ah! The following video was shared by urban explorer and paranormal enthusiast Leo, who went with a friend of his to a supposedly haunted shop. The shop is not accessible and fenced off, so the two were doing a live on his profile and showing the surroundings to their viewers. Of course, this wasn't as satisfying as they had hoped, since not having access to the building doesn't really help in urban exploration. However, his phone captured something unusual when live streaming to his audience. Bro. Hey. Hey. So creepy face he said. So we're gonna see a face somewhere, right? I feel like it's gonna be behind them. So they're gonna. Oh, hey. Yep. And now it kind of doesn't look like that face. Wait, what just happened? It's like a mannequin head. It's a mannequin head. Ah, that's normal. That's normal, I guess. Maybe After analyzing not. the footage, it became clear that a pale face was staring out of one of the windows. Oh, which honestly gave the two explosions. Oh, I was looking at this, but it was here? Of course, quite some goosebumps. The building is abandoned for quite some time and, as stated, nobody has access to it, making them believe that they might have captured one of the ghosts that is said oh, to haunt this building. Brother, brother. What a scary thought, isn't it? Bruh. I don't know, man. Uh -uh, I don't know, bruh. Yeah, this one. Yeah, I didn't see it. I was looking at the, the, the mannequin head. I thought that that was what he was talking about. And then I was like, bro, like it's just a mannequin head, right? Hey, this is a it? submission from Ariel Gomez, who states that the capture stems from a friend and that it was taken in an old hospital in Buenos Aires, Argentina. The girl in the capture was visiting somebody in the hospital and decided to take a selfie with her friend who came along. They Bad stood idea. in front of a mirror in the bathroom when they took it. They were quite shocked when checking the capture right afterwards. Bad idea, bad idea. A shockingly creepy apparition was captured, standing right behind Why the is it always like, you know, there are moments when you see pictures like that in these videos, but whenever they say there's like someone like a ghost in the background, you don't clearly see their faces. Even their faces is kind of, the quality is kind of bad, but you you still see it, right? But 
the ghost face is always like invisible you always see like a silhouette that's like a jacket he's wearing that's like the hair um that probably is the eyebrow that's like the nose the eyes kind of like you don't see the eyes but you're kind of your brain is trying to make it right like my brain is trying to process that and is like okay that's an eyebrow that's a that's a head that's a hair jacket that's neck and here's gotta be a mo uh, mouth but you don't see that in in reality Damn. the two women of course they did not see this thing at the time and they are absolutely certain that nobody yeah. else was with them in the bathroom double exposure is not a thing anymore with phone cameras so do we have to assume that an entity from another dimension was photobombing the if you're watching at night my my um, my bad for actually making those faces or maybe um it's not my bad <laughs> no nah, my bad my bad for making those faces bro too <laughs> might be scary in new york the head looks a little bit skull like really really creepy yeah don't look behind you don't look behind you bro Hey, hey, imaginary friend, hey! The following incident was a terrifying oh, encounter shit. that a young woman had shared on her profile. Los oh, Polionero STV. The mother states that her young baby son seems to be talking more and more about his imaginary little friend that likes to visit him in his room. And the boy is talking a lot to him, apparently. Bro, those dogs, I just freaked me out. The mother started recording these encounters to share with the family. Such was the case today. She started filming once her little son told her about his friend and that he was with them this day. Oh yeah? I gotta make sure like my aim is good there, okay? I got the finger on the trigger. We're gonna take out the, the finger from the trigger. Okay, it's time. Gotta make sure. So the kid is going somewhere. Oh wait, 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 Seemingly uneasy, the young mother is turning around and she can Bro, that's crazy, okay, I don't, I don't even know what happened. But all I'm like, bro, that sound effect and the kid talking, I was like, bruh, 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 bruh. and the mother ran away though, like, bro, your child is there, bro, take your kid and then run away. But is this video real or fake? I don't know, man, it seems like it's real because the mama just got scared like that, bro. Captures a shadow image of what looks to be a little kid standing in the dark kitchen, staring at her. What? I don't see it, okay. Hola, amigo, amigo, where is that amigo though? I don't see it. And it did scare her so bad that it took her a few days until she decided to share this encounter on her profile. She believes that this imaginary friend to be not that imaginary after all now. I don't see it though. I really don't see it. Like, I don't see it, man. Where, 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 I don't see it. Let's hope that this doesn't get out of hand. He's like looking down, so he must be in front of him. Is it hair? Can a brother get like an arrow, arrow pointed out or something? Like, bruh. Is it the hair? Like this? I don't know. I didn't see it though. The following is a recording which stems from a memorial celebration which was held for the fallen soldiers. Two young men who were part of the military themselves were Four giving speeches the at angels, the time. Fallen soldiers, Important I mean. to note is that nobody was situated behind them and the area was supposedly secured. However, it would appear that a man was standing just a few inches behind them. Oh damn, brother! Got the got the suit on by the looks. He's uh got the ca cap as well. Oh my god. That looks like a normal person to me though. Just like someone looking at be like. Several Bruh. eyewitness reports state that nobody saw this man behind the trees. Maybe they didn't look though, you know? Looks like homie's smiling though, like laughing, he's like uh, Kumbaya. He's like, and okay, that many oh. believe this to be a manifestation of a fallen soldier in full uniform. Yeah, full uniform, huh? That's an I thought at right first here. that maybe a local farmer accidentally made his way into the recording. Could be. But based on these eyewitness accounts, my theory is probably out of the window. Mm. Well, yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, click on this video on the screen keep that night going man it's not gonna last that long click on it subscribe and i'll see you right there